Hello and welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you quick and easy how to fillet catfish. We don't always just saltwater fish. Sometimes we freshwater fish and it's hard to beat those blue catfish for eating. But a friend of mine had a little trouble filleting them, said he didn't like cleaning them, so I told him I would show him the easy way to do it. So we went out and caught a few and I'll show you in this video the easy way. All the tools you'll need are linked in the description below. You guys that catch catfish, if you clean them the old-fashioned way of skinning them, nailing them to a tree and all that other crazy stuff, this is going to change your life. Hit that like button down there and don't forget to subscribe button. Check this out. Again, I'm gonna put links to this in the description below. A good cut resistant glove. If you guys are cleaning fish without one of these things, definitely get one. They're worth their weight in gold. Keep your hands safe from getting all cut up. Next thing you'll need is a Mr. Twister Electric Fisherman. I've had this knife right here for, gosh, probably at least 15 years. This is only the second one I ever bought. Still works great. Bucket of ice water, cutting board, and of course, a volunteer. All right, these catfish have a bone right here. I'm gonna try to zoom that in with my editing software, but right there, there's a big bone. Start behind that, a little bit of an angle towards the head. Just cut down the backbone through the belly. Now there's a spine right here, obviously. So go ahead and flatten this blade out at the spine, and just follow that backbone all the way down the fish. A lot easier if you don't have to work around a camera. Now just go ahead and leave this attached, assuming you have enough room on your cutting board. Flip that whole fillet over. The board like that. Use your knife to separate the skin from the meat. On a little bit of an angle. I'm using probably about a 30 degree angle and a little downward pressure on this thing. And that's all you need. And the blade will do the work. Skins right off of there. Look at that fillet. Perfectly skinned. Same on the other side. Right behind that bone to the spine. Flatten your blade out. Through the ribs. Ride that spine all the way down. Flip the flay over and skin it. It gets too much easier than that. Now that you got the skin off and the fillet off, we just need to cut the ribs out. They're real easy to find. Catfish are not a real bony fish. Very light, flaky white meat. Those ribs are right there. You can be real surgical about this. I usually don't. Get right in there and cut that out. Now, here's a nice little touch. That right here, there's this little white nerve line. If you get a hold of that and pull that out of that fillet, that's something that's kind of nasty in the finished fillet. You can get rid of that and it'll make your catfish fillets that much better. So there you go. If you got a little piece of skin that you miss, just get rid of it. No big deal. Look at that. That is a nice, nice fillet right there. Ready to cook. That little bone right there that we missed. No big deal. We're just going to cut that off with the ribs. There are no more bones in a catfish to worry about. Now I'm going to find that nerve line again. It's right there. runs right down their little lateral line. And it's real easy to remove. You just grab a hold of it and pull it right out. Done. There's another great looking filet, ready for the fryer. Now let's do one real time.
comes out. Get the rims out. How long was that? Let's do one more nice one real time. Getting around this big bone at the top is the toughest. nice good looking filet and in no time at all you have a nice tub of wonderful clean catfish fillets ready to cook so there you go that's how to clean catfish the easy way links are in the description to all the stuff the cut glove the knife the whole works about time for me to get a new set of blades for that knife but again it is a good 10 years old and it has filleted hundreds and hundreds if not thousands of fish I'll also put a little link up there in the cards to a couple of our other fish cleaning videos that might help you out with some saltwater fish. Hit that subscribe button down there. Don't forget the bell icon so you don't miss any videos. And give me that thumbs up like button. We'll see you next time.